Hey guys, it's Jenna, and I'm really excited to share with you my pre-renation journey. I like to share some leadership qualities that I've developed throughout my pre-renation journey. My willingness to lead and help others began to develop as can be seen through my breaking down the barriers experience. I led a group of people in order to help them realize that you can't judge someone based on only their 10%. The marble jar activity helped me increase the comfort level of expressing emotions in front of other people. The blindfolded walk helped me increase the level of trust that I had in my classmates. It also showed me that my classmates could be going through similar things as me and I wouldn't realize and so I need to lean on them for help. I began feeling more comfortable speaking in front of a group of people after all of the activities that we would do in class. A few of these activities were skits as well as presentations as well as sharing a video that we made at the end of second semester. Although I was nervous, I was confident that my peers would not judge me. Another thing that I'd like to share is that I plan on continuing to use my skills. I like to smile at strangers and hopefully that will bring them some joy into their lives for that day, as well as checking up on my friends and my fellow classmates. I'd like to connect with my peer mediators that were in my class and make sure that the juniors are doing well next year. I'd also like to use these skills when I become a vet in the future. I like to use my skills when I become a vet because when I have to give bad news to a parent of one of the animals that I'm taking care of, it might be useful to use some active listening or some distracting, like asking them to go get some coffee and thinking it through before they make any decisions. I can also use my skills in any relationship that I have now or in the future. I'd be able to de-escalate a situation so that I don't add to any more conflict. I'd like to say thank you to not only my classmates, but also my sergeant guys. My classmates were there for me when I needed a shoulder to cry on or just someone to make my day a little bit brighter. Ms. Rodriguez was able to help us create an environment and grow as people where we felt comfortable. And that's not something that you get in every classroom. And so my hope is that next year, class of 2021, whether it be IPMs or APMs, they're able to get the same type of learning and the same type of environment that we've created. Our type of environment was a little bit tricky because we went from classroom to online learning. And although we've been a little bit distant, I feel that we bonded in the beginning and that bond can never be broken. I hope that next year's students will be able to create that bond, whether they're going from online learning to the classroom, or if it's all online, or if it's all in the classroom. I hope that they will be able to do it.